There he is. I like it. I like it. Looking good. All you need now is a snowmobile. Yeah. What is this, winter squam? Oh, there. How are you guys doing in here? Okay, let's see that. Hey, you puppy. Now it's working. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, there he is again. He's camera shy. Hello, my fellow Simply New Englanders. Welcome back to another episode. So today we're going to take it down a notch. I've been doing a lot of humor stuff lately, but uh, we're going to get back to the roots of the channel. I'm on my way to a small pond in Belmont, New Hampshire, going to go meet up with my son and his girlfriend. We're going to do a little bit of ice fishing. Always fun when uh, I get to hang out with him. He called me uh, the last night and said, hey dad, what are you doing? Want to go do some ice fishing? I'm not one that really enjoys the cold, which is probably why I've been doing more humor videos lately. There he goes, another Jeep wave. No jokes today though on that one. Sorry, I hate to hate to disappoint. I, I just my brain's not in that mode today. So anyway, I'm gonna go meet up with him and try my hand at some ice fishing. I'm gonna fill you in on a little secret. I've never been ice fishing before. All right, so here we go. As you can see, ice fishing is really a big deal around here. They even plow the power line so the people can get down there. It should be fun. All right, so here we are. Um, looks like Again, in Belmont, New Hampshire, uh, off of uh, the backside of Lake Winnesquam. There's a little pond down here. It's where my son goes ice fishing. I'm gonna grab uh, a couple of the things I need and uh, let's take off and let's go check this out. There he is down there. You can see him waiting for me. Hey, buddy. There he is. I like it. I like it. Looking good. All you need now is a snowmobile. All you need now is to get your snowmobile out here. I like your bob house. What? You got your own little ice skating rink over here. Uh, that was just all used to cool. Nice. All right, so here we are. We're at the Clam 5600 Love Shack here on Winnesquam Lake. That's a cove off of Winnesquam. Cove off of Winnesquam. Let's check this out. Give me the dime tour. And dime tour? The dime tour. Sunny. Yeah. I you. She's about that. Well, hello there. Hi. How you guys doing in here? Wow, it's about what? 70 degrees in here? Yeah, At least. nice. Got our fishing holes. Got hers over here. Looking all snug and warm in here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely. What do you got? Running off of propane? Oh yeah. Keeping it warm? It's about 80 degrees in there. You got your homemade uh, pallet yep. cart there. Nice, nice. What we got over here? Some stuff in the bucket. Ooh, little frying pan. Got the auger. Using the DeWalt 20 volt brushless. Yeah, that's my boy. Yeah. Well, let's go see how this is done. What do you got going on over here? All right, explain to the viewers how this is done. I'm fishing bottom right now. All right, so you're fishing bottom. Use a little minnow. Okay, let's see that. Using a little minnow right there. Puts that just in. Drop it down. Drop it down. And just let it sink. 
and you put your flag in the hole. Show me how to do it. All right, it takes a minute. It's okay. Once I get the clear in, then I can just drop the black because that's it'll sink fast. So it has a sinker on it? No, the line's just heavy. Line is heavy? Is there a certain type of line you need to use? I use 36 pound test. So 36 pound test. For my so go ahead, and go ahead and explain this while you do it. All right, so if you get a fish on, it's gonna set this off and that's how that goes. So you go ahead and set your flag down. Just set it in the hole and leave it and hope that the flag goes off. Set it in the hole and hope that the flag goes off. What kind of fish you getting today? Uh, just pickerel and some crappie and perch. So here's one that he already has set up and waiting on. Yeah. Here we are. All right. So guys, this is my first time literally ice fishing as a 47 year old New Englander. Been on the ice, never fished on the ice. Yeah, nothing again. Nothing again. Check them every hour or so. Fish on about 16 inches of ice. About 16 inches of ice right here? Yep. That's cool. It's enough for a few trucks and all that. 16 inches. I'm feeling safe. Cool. Nice and quiet out here. Go over here and check this one out. See what's going on. Flag is still down. I'm gonna take a walk over to the bigger part of uh, Lake Winnesquam. Again, uh, Belmont, New Hampshire. Let's see what's going on down here. For a day that's this cold, it's freaking warm in there. A little too warm for me. I'm just not like, I think we're down to about 20 degrees out. I'm heating up in there. Holy smokes. Oh, it's crazy. You gotta come outside to cool down. Bald head is sweating. Oh, yeah. Lots of Valentine's Day treats. It's Saturday, so uh, it's right before Valentine's Day. All right. Brought you guys some treats. Oh. Valentine's Day gifts. Thank you. Oh, well, thank you. Go ahead and check it out. Don't be camera shy. Hey. Hey. The Krabby Patties. Krabby Patties. You guys can split those. Oh, I And some Russes. Oh, yeah. Obviously, the Russes. Yeah, you have to. Dad's favorite. Thank you, yeah, Dad. Yeah, you're welcome. Maybe I'll get lucky, I'll hook up. Yeah. I don't know. Another bike should be going around. So this thing's pretty cool, huh? The shack. So it's got the, it's got the uh, plastic floor. You can yep. go in from here, you can go in from the back of the side. You can fit what? Comfortably? Four people without fishing. Four people without fishing if need be. Two people away. Yeah, two with seats, one standing. Yeah. Maybe with a butt in someone's face. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. So tell me about this cooler. It's just 
keep my bait alive. So you're using the shiners. Freebill. Aquabater. Aquabater. Yeah. Just keep the shiners alive. You can see he's cupping some air. He's got the setup here. He's all good to go. And good now if he can just catch himself a fish. You mm. caught anything today, Sen? Nope. Nothing? No, nope. she caught I caught stuff when she was gone. Oh, always how it is, right? Typical fisherman story. Okay. You should have seen it. It was this big. Oh, I had videos. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take one of those bad boys. Oh, not a marshmallow one. What the heck? Yeah. Yeah, my boy. Look at that. My boy. Yeah. Out here being the man doing the ice fishing thing. Wait, come on out. How not to treat your girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> oh. As the male buffalo displays his power to the younger female, this is how the mating ritual begins. Notice the strength of the larger male, he is dominant over the weaker female. Will she survive? No, no. The male will overcome. Really? Next time on Animal Planet and find out why we call them animals. Hey, you puppy. Easy. Easy. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share. We are out of here. Time to go home. Getting tired. Into the road. <laughs>